A man has been arrested in connection with a massive fire that ripped through a multi-storey car park at Luton Airport. The blaze, which broke out on the evening of October 10th, destroyed 1,500 vehicles and caused the structure to partially collapse, with the debris of some cars piled up within its blackened storeys. Four firefighters and a member of airport staff were also taken to hospital after suffering smoke inhalation. More than 15 crews from Bedfordshire Fire Service tackled the blaze, which began in Terminal Car Park 2. A man aged in his 30s has since been questioned on suspicion of criminal damage, but released on bail while inquiries continue. It's understood the man was arrested as a precaution and the police investigation so far suggests the fire started accidentally due to a vehicle fault. Previously, the fire service confirmed that the vehicle involved was a diesel car. In a statement, Bedfordshire Police said, Police last week arrested a man in his 30s on suspicion of criminal damage in connection to their investigation into a significant fire in a car park at London Luton Airport. They added as many as 1,500 cars were inside the car park when the fire broke out, and it's unlikely that any will be salvageable.